This is Cheryl from Life is Short, Make It Sweet. Today is a ladies only discussion. So I wanna to talk to you about something that I think we could all benefit from. So if you're a lady, stay tuned. If you're a guy, then you're just wanting to be nosy. You wanna to listen to our conversation. That's okay. Listen, cause guess what? You may have a wife, a sister, I don't know, somebody in your life that you can help. So share this with them. It's called Go Go Girl. And I bought this over at Walmart. I haven't looked at it yet. I thought it would be good to do it together. So let's open this. It says open here. This could be interesting, people. Because, <laughs> you know, sometimes you can't really open things, right? All right, so we're going to open it up. There it is. Whoop, got it. Okay, then we're gonna pull this out. I think you gotta be very careful pulling it out because it's plastic and you don't wanna rip and get a hole in it. That's what I'm thinking. All right, on here it says it's good for camping, boating, travel, festivals, and sports. Go Go Girl allows women the convenience of standing to urinate. It's clean, portable, discreet, and usable. Don't take life sitting down. So on here it says it contains one Go Girl tissue and a Go Girl storage bag. So we're gonna open it up. Wow, <laughs> here's the tissue. Hope you don't need too much. And then, uh, you know, women, we're not built like men. We don't just shake it and dry. So yeah, we're gonna have to have some tissue. But, <clears throat> Here's your bag to store it in. It also has on here how to use it, best results. All right. It says maintain a seal on the back is important. And practice at home. I agree. So I haven't used it, obviously. So we're going to practice at home. I'm not going to demonstrate that. Okay, so this is kind of interesting. So it looks like you're going to put it on. Just like this. So the deep side's gonna go down under and this is gonna be on top. And it even gives you a little picture here of the right way and the wrong way. And um, it makes sense that you'd wanna have this deep part down. So you're, you're going to push it up against your vagina and then just pee. Have to practice this at home in a toilet. It also says on here up. So that'll remind you to have this part up. I'm sure if you were to use this a lot, you would figure it out. But that's not really all that big. I mean, here's my hand. So you can tell it's not any bigger than my hand, but how convenient. And the reason I wanted to try this was because I thought, you know, how many times do you find yourself in a situation where you need to go to the bathroom and now you're gonna squat down. And let's face it, ladies, squatting to go pee is not fun. Because when you get down there, now you get, you're looking to see how far are your feet apart because you don't want the pee coming down and splattering all over your clothes or your shoes. And you also wanna make sure, are you on a hill? Are you going downhill? Or are you going uphill? I mean, as women, we have to think about these things. It's not a real easy task. So, I thought this would be great. You could just stand there and go like the guys do. The other part is, is if you are a living in your RV, you're living in the RV, whether it be part-time, full-time, but you're spending a lot of time in it, you can find yourself out in the woods. You might do a little day hike, or maybe your tank's getting a little full, or you wanna watch how full that tank's going. Well, guess what? You could be like the guys, no worry, go. That's what they do, right? So I thought, this is really great. Um, yeah, because I'm hoping to have a, go from a Class C to a Class B van here. I don't know when, but soon. And um, my tank size is gonna be small. So I'm thinking this might be part of my solution for that. The other thing, and I'm not a fan of this, but let's talk about it. I mean, we're talking, stuff that people just don't talk about. 
if you really had to go and you didn't want to fill your tank up, you could probably go into a bottle like the guys do. Just put the bottle there, right? And then take the bottle. Now, I would take it in, probably put it in a bag or whatever, and next time I went into the store or whatever, throw it down the toilet. I, um, these people who take their pee bottles and dump them at Walmart in the parking lot, I'm sorry. Be responsible. Figure it out and be responsible. But uh, this is, I think this is fantastic. Got it at Walmart, I believe it was $9.97 in the camping department. And uh, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna see how it works. Uh, you have any comments, ideas of, you know, some of you, this may just gross you out. You may think I wouldn't do that, but seriously, <laughs> I have done a lot of camping in my life. And I've been, I hiked down into Haleakala Crater in uh, Hawaii. I was down in there for, I think a week, week and a half. And uh, it's just not fun to have to pee as a woman. You know, we have no choice when it comes to the other. And neither do the guys. I mean, you gotta go number two, you're gonna go, but you don't usually get the mess that you get with the pee. It's not splashing all over the place, we hope. Nasty. Anyway. Leave me any comments that you might have. Let me know what you think. And uh, maybe I'll do a follow-up and let you know how it worked because I haven't actually tried it yet, but I'm going to. And I'll practice at home because guess what? I don't want any surprises. Would that be horrible? You're out in the woods, first time, you put it on, you don't do it right, and the pee goes all over your clothes. Oh my gosh. Okay. Me. All right, gonna try it, gonna practice it. And then it, like I said, it comes with this bag and it gives you instructions, tells you how to maintain it, keep it clean, stuff like that, and store it. And it has that uh, little sticky thing so that you can actually close it up and have it sealed. So, um, little bitty toilet paper. All right, there we go. Good luck. Go get yourself a go-go girl and post some comments. I'm interested to find out how this works for you. Take care. Bye. <laughs>